And the egg is finally finished after 56 hours and 14 minutes. Um, I believe it took about 650 grams of uh, PLA. Um, I used Hatchbox White uh, PLA. Um, I printed the original size. This is the original size um, that you can download off Thingiverse. I didn't print the inside of this one. It messed up, uh, so I never got a chance to reprint it. But after I printed this one, actually I printed one of these before for my son, and he absolutely loved it. Um, so I started this one for him, and then he asked me one day if I could make him a big one. So I thought, why not? So that's the original. And this one is scaled up 500%. Um, as I said, it took 60 hours to print. This was actually my third attempt. The first two attempts, I got a clogged nozzle about 24 hours in, which was rather um, disappointing. But this one uh, finished. And then inside of it, let me open it up. There's the inside. And inside we have out of the same hatchbox PLA blue, we have the truck. This is the truck. Uh, this one actually printed perfectly the first time. Um, this one took about 24 hours to print. Um, came out really well opens it rolls on carpet uh, actually uh, fairly well um, my son's played with it a few times now so it's gonna get the ultimate test when I bring it home and let my three kids play with it but uh but no it fits in there nicely it actually fits in there with actually a lot of wiggle room um, the tolerances at this size are a lot more a lot bigger so they it fits in there nicely. There it is. The surprise egg at 500%. And there is the original size.